Hello friends. The question is like this. We have to evaluate the integral x square plus x plus 1 upon x plus 1 whole square into x plus 2 with respect to x. Okay. Now, to solve this integral or to integrate this function, first of all we see that the degree of the numerator is less than the degree of the denominator and denominator is in the form of factors. So the best method out here to solve this question is to resolve this fraction into its partial fraction. Right? So we shall firstly resolve this fraction into its partial fraction. Okay? And the partial fraction of this fraction can be written as a upon x plus 1 plus b upon x plus 1 whole square because here the factors are repeating and the maximum power is 2. So we are going to get two terms of x plus 1, 1 a upon x plus 1 and second b upon x plus 1 whole square plus c upon x plus 2. Right? Now we are going to take the LCM of the right hand side to obtain uh, left hand side as it is and on right hand side I'm going to get a into x plus 1 into x plus 2 b into x plus 2 plus c into x plus 1 whole square upon x plus 1 whole square into x plus 2. So these denominators can be cancelled and we are going to get x squared plus x plus 1 is equal to a into x plus 1 into x plus 2 b into x plus 2 plus c into x plus 1 whole square and we can mark this as equation number 1. Okay now we are going to calculate the value of a, b and c with the help of this equation 1. Okay, now to obtain the value of uh, b, I am going to place x plus 1 as equal to 0 or x is equal to minus 1 in equation number 1. So I am going to obtain minus 1 is square, minus 1 plus 1 is equal to a into minus 1 plus 1 into minus 1 plus 2 plus b into minus 1 plus 2 plus c into minus 1 plus 1 whole square. So this will become 0, this will become 0 and I am going to obtain 1 is equal to b or b is equal to 1. So we get b is equal to 1 as one of the value. Similarly placing x plus 2 as equal to 0 or x is equal to minus 2 in equation number 1, I am going to get minus 2 square minus 2 plus 1 is equal to a into minus 2 plus 1 into minus 2 plus 2 plus b into minus 2 plus 2 plus c into minus 2 plus 1 whole square. Now minus 2 square would be 4, 4 minus 2 would be 2, 2 plus 1 3, this will become 0, this will become 0, this will be minus 1 square or simply c or I am going to get 3 is equal to c or c is equal to 3. Now we have calculated the value of b and c, now to calculate the value of a, I am going to place x is equal to 0 in equation number 1 and use the value of b and c to calculate the value of a. Let us see how we are going to do it. So on placing x is equal to 0 in this equation, I am going to get these two terms 0 plus 1 is equal to a into 0 plus 1 into 0 plus 2 plus b into 0 plus 2 plus c into 0 plus 1 whole square. Okay, so I am going to get 1 is equal to 2a. This you can see this will be 1 and this will be 2. So 1 into 2, 2. So I am going to get 2a. This will be equal to 2b. This will be equal to c. Now, placing b is equal to 1 here and c is equal to 3, I am going to get 1 is equal to 2a plus 2 into 1, 2 plus 3. So this will be equal to 5. 5 goes here. This is going to give me minus 4 or a is equal to or 2 is equal to minus 4 or a is equal to minus 2. So I can write that the partial fraction of this fraction as equal to minus 2 upon x plus 1 that is the value of a upon x plus 1 plus 1 upon x plus 1 whole square plus 3 upon x plus 2. Okay. So the integration of this function is uh, is equal to the integration of minus 2 times the integration of uh, x plus 1 dx plus integration of 1 upon 1 plus x whole square plus 3 into integration of 1 upon x plus 2 with respect to x. So what I have done, I have uh, calculated the partial fraction of this fraction and I have replaced these fraction for these terms and performed the integration. Okay, now I am going to solve these integrals to get the answer. So this will be equal to 
minus 2 log x plus 1 because integration of 1 upon x dx is equal to log x so this is x plus 1 so I'm going to get minus 2 log x plus 1 this will be equal to minus 1 upon x plus 1 here we have applied the formula for integration of x to the power of n which is equal to x to the power of n plus 1 upon n plus 1 here the minus uh, here the power was minus 2 so I get this term okay and similarly the integration of 3 into 1 upon x plus 2 dx is equal to 3 log of x plus 2 plus c which is my required answer so this is how I'm going to solve this question friends thanks for watching my video to watch more of these super videos and for the latest updates subscribe and like the videos on these channels on YouTube HSK Shiksha and Math Help by HSK thank you